Okay, so I want to bring some awareness about Mantis pet because I think at the moment it's completely broken. So what's happening now is this guy's dead. Yeah, he's dead because he will not be able to move at all. What's happening is I'm casting this Mantis special move scroll that binds a person for 5 seconds. And the thing that's special about the scroll is that you can cast it again and it will renew the bind. Meaning, if you have infinite supplies of summoning potions, infinite supplies of special move points, you can kill your enemy. And yes, I know that at the moment I should be, you know, using range because he's playing magic, but I just want to show you, it doesn't matter. I'm going to exhaust all of his supplies and he's going to die. What also happens is that he cannot fight back. Yeah, that's uh, another thing that the scroll does. He cannot fight back. I'm pretty sure at this point he's trying to... Um, uh, he's trying to, you know, escape, but, okay, he said bye-bye, okay, he's dead. I'm gonna show you one more clip of killing this one guy, I don't think he was risking anything too much, so again, even if this is a bug abuse, I should not be banned as, you know, nothing was lost or anything like that. So this guy is playing magic, you know, he's eating, he thinks, well, in 10 seconds I can bang, but the truth is, you will never be able to bank because of my pet. As long as I'm spamming those crawls, as long as I have those summoning potions, yeah, that's how easy it is. So if you're smuggling, that's why I don't want to see this pet so overpowered. If you're smuggling and somebody freezes you, you're fucked. You are never able to move for like a hundred casts. I mean, if you have a pack yak with full of rock tails or Saladomin brews, eventually you're gonna run out of that. Because you can get frozen for 5 minutes without moving a single tile. And I'm gonna be playing the last clip now. Again, nothing special is going to happen, but so we can get a general idea of how the pet works. That guy is never going to move because I froze him once. That means I can freeze him infinite amounts of time. And again, this needs to be fixed because if I'm smuggling items, you know, if I get frozen by someone else, there is no counterplay to this. You get frozen, you die. Again, doesn't matter how much food you have. I mean, look at this poor guy. Good thing he did not have anything on him, because if he did, I would be pissed to hell. Because, you know, you, you, take, you prepare, you take food, I'm going to smuggle something, even if the guy freezes me, I can still run away. No, you can't. Because somebody's using Mantis Pet. And the reason why I'm making this video is because I've seen a few people post about this on Reddit, but it never got any attention. Even though this is like the most serious problem at the moment. Maybe it's not as bad in RuneScape 3. But in here, because of smuggling, well, I guess it does make smuggling a little bit harder. But no counterplay to that. You can't escape. One freeze equals you're dead. Anyway, that's gonna be all for today. Hope you enjoyed it and hopefully I'll see you tomorrow. Bye!